Hi guys, this is my first video in English on my channel and today I'll show you guys how to install the G-Flex on your machine, okay? The first step, we will have to open the G-Flex website and I'll show you guys how to open it. You just type G-Flex on your Google and it will be the first website, okay? We click it and there will be this page. In this page, we will click here and download it and download this file okay okay let's go okay I downloaded now we're gonna open the file extract the the files here okay I will start it in my desktop and we will have the GFlex, okay? The folder GFlex. What are you gonna do now? We open it and click in the folder bin and edit this file, okay? We will edit. The first step here, we're gonna delete this. We delete it, okay? The same thing here okay and now we're gonna change this okay we will put your directory your directory not that okay how I know my directed is the director that is your gflex in my case I will click here and this is my director but without the bin just this okay I copy this I copy and paste here I delete this and paste here okay but I already have a, a file and I will not do it here because my deflex I will not save is not here my deflex is on my local disk C okay he is here I will open here and it's like this I where okay it's here C G flex okay C G flex you guys should do it because it's more easy because you're gonna do just this we will not put oh desktop oh documents oh downloads so it's better put in the local disk c okay after this we're gonna change the path of your computer how i do this i will open the path it's just type path and we will open for your account edit the path for your account okay not from the system your account we click here and now we're gonna do we're gonna create a new variable okay we click in new the name of the variable will be jflex home okay you have to do it in the same way that i am doing okay because if you if you don't do, probably it will be a, a mistake. Probably you will do a error in the next, okay? Let's do it. Jflex home. And here, the value of the variable will be the directory uh, where your jflex is, okay? In my case, local disk C gflex I copy this and paste here okay and now I click here and will be created this variable gflex home and my directory it's because when he will search the the gflex you'll be to gflex home in the case 
is the, the folder where is my deflex, okay? And we'll do another thing. What is this thing? We will edit the real path. Here we created a variable for the, for the your account, a variable. But now we will edit the path, okay? If your, your account does not have a path, you will create it, okay? In my case, I created it. It's just click here in new. Here, wait, I will explain first if you have, okay? If you have the path, we will, cl we will click and edit and just put here the directory, but not the directory. Now we we'll put the directory and the folder bin, okay? If you doesn't have new variable name, we'll put path, okay? Can be in caps lock, there's no problem with this. And here in the variable, we will put the directory. Yes, the director again, but now the director will be with the folder bin. Okay, in the folder bin has these two files and we needed the two, that two files, those two files. So copy and okay, where is and past. Okay, and we click, okay. Here we created the path and here they will be here. This variable and this path, okay? Do with this, your deflex, it's waited, it's ready to run in your machine. For we, to we test, we will open the CMD, okay? And just type G flex and click it on enter okay if the this program open it your deflex it's okay you can use it to do whatever you want to the java and whatever okay if doesn't open wait okay if this message open in your CMD, you did something wrong. So you have to rewatch the video and do again the steps. Okay? It's that. I hope that you guys can do it. Okay? And any questions you can write on the comments. Okay? I will answer all the questions. So, goodbye, it's that. See you guys later.